Hi, we're gonna be watching episode nine. Don't try to fight him like that! What? I have to. There's no way I'm leaving you here. You are in no shape to fret over me! Oh, Why great. Why don't you pay attention to my warning, you idiot? <laughs> that is true. He did say they're gonna go for his eyes. Why must you be like this, Bonnie Dust? I'm sorry. What did you just say? <gasps> oh no, the name! That raven hair. Get your hands off. Sapphire. You're being a bit too touchy for my liking. My word! Bonnie Toss as I live and breathe! I like to breathe too! <laughs> Um, a big fan, are we? So the rumors about you being used by the vampires were true. <gasps> oh, he's gonna think that he's rescuing him. Perhaps they're holding from your loved this ones from no way. Oh, you poor oh, boy. Soul. <laughs> <laughs> oh. just never change, do you? Oh. Always looking down on everyone, casting your pity where it's not wanted. He definitely has been part of this group in the past. He knows too much about it. Oh Lord, please have mercy upon this lost soul. He knows not the foolishness of the blasphemous words that he speaks against your holy name. Oh. Here, look into my eyes. The best I'd rather not. The Savior's love is to behold the way He's really touchy, is he? <laughs> there is nothing for you to fear, little lost lamb. Great. We have a religious fanatic, don't we? Promise you. Oh my you god. The clutches of the vampires. What the Come on, man. This is nauseating. I agree. What kind of weapon is that? Oh, is starting to come back. Go I knew the Ooh. He's fast. Well, yeah, he's definitely fast for a human, I will say that. They use drugs to enhance their fighting prowess. Uh oh. <sighs> wow. Even with no way we can like this, it's still Impressive. able to die. I've never seen a vampire's mobility return so promptly after being incapacitated by that light. Please hold on. If you just listen to me, I could. As I said. Yeah, he, I don't think he's going to uh, listen to any vampire. He seems to hate them with a passion. Trying to escape. Oh my God! It detaches. <gasps> it extends. You're not going what anywhere. What the? <laughs> not today. A segmented sword? That also attaches and detaches. That's incredible. Oh wow. Okay. Let's see how good you are without your weapon. He has the other one. He can what? He can also electrify it? Are you kidding me? What a versatile weapon. You're finished. Nice. <laughs> this is what we call teamwork. Ah, Maria, George, bonsoir. Oh no, your head is bleeding, sir. I'm so glad to see you. I lost my way and had an altercation with a couple of infiltrators. Now then, time to hunt. I don't know how I feel about this organization just yet. He's the worst kind of person, no way. I despise sanctimonious fools who look malice, clear in the face, and pretend it's something else. <laughs> I don't think this is a laughing situation, guys. Sorry for laughing. And there's no way, okay? He's, like, injured. Can he use the Book of no Vanitas on humans? Or is, does it only affect vampires? His name is Moral. He used to be a chasseur until his obsessive vampire research took a turn for madness and got him expelled. There's a number. 128. What is it's that a production mean? number. Production? All these kidnappings. They weren't Their committed numbers? by yourselves. Not normal ones, anyway. They're enhanced humans. The results of unorthodox experimentation. Oh. To try to even the odds between uh, humans and vampires. There's always mad scientists experimenting on humans. <laughs> In every show I watch, I swear. It is him! <gasps> the same lad I once knew! Welcome home! Finally, Home. the precious test subject has returned. Test subject! The vampire <gasps> of the blue moon may have taken you away from me. Was he captured here and experimented on by that scientist? And then the vampire of the blue moon infiltrated this, the catacombs or whatever this place is, and like saved Vanitas? Are we finally starting to piece together some of Vanitas' story? <laughs> What? The what the fuck is going on? Against us? The astromite inside is glowing bright red. Is this the scientist is doing? We were on the trail, but then they circled around behind us like shadows. 
They oh. jumped us. And then what? we were blinded by an eldritch light. That was when I understood that the what hunters in the world? had become the hunted. Wow. Well, this is definitely not going to be an easy capture, is it? I mean, the Book of Vanitas can even manipulate machines? Not exactly. <gasps> nice. But it did allow me to tamper with the Astermite that powers the automatons. Oh. And I'm sure you're smart enough to put together why that's possible. I'm not. Did you Explain rewrite it. the formula? Precisely. Oh. The strong <laughs> I could have figured that out if I formula. really thought about this it. This is vampire steel. So I put it to use. How do you know this place well enough to out-navigate Roland and his subordinates? I think we can guess. What is this Moreau trying to achieve? He was captured here and experimented on for some reason. I still have so many questions. Both of my parents were killed by a vampire. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Because the Chasseurs, in their infinite righteousness, came along and rescued me from suffering the same fate. Rescued. I was trained by the church as one of their recruits. Wow. But before I was ready to join the ranks, Moreau took a liking to me and made me his guinea pig instead. What did he do to you? It almost sounds as if he experienced some traumatic experiences. Despite that, you don't hold a grudge against vampires? As far as I'm concerned, there's very little that separates humans from vampires. Hmm. A monster is a monster. Yeah, I'm guessing he was not treated that well. Face again! I'm sick of it! Lower your voice! What the heck? I can't stand it when you look like that! Look it like what? so angry! Yeah? Well, this is what I look like, so get used to- What the flip is happening? Oh my god. <gasps> Let's flip and go! That's no way to treat a young lady! I don't think right now uh, you need to be worried about chivalry. <laughs> no, overruled. I overrule your overruling. It must you be so difficult? Trust me, this is the easiest way to deal with so called men of Their dynamic is hilarious. It. We'll just anger him more. There is no peaceful resolution. Yeah, with you do I don't think he that. wants if we just a peaceful resolution with a I'm vampire. Sure this is exactly what makes you people so weak. Huh? If you don't like my way of doing things, by all means, go it alone. I'll be better off. Working with a naive fool like you will probably be the death of me someday. You're really correct about that because Noe said it himself that he will be the death of you. Uh, message received, Vanitas. We are going to take a hostage after all. Huh? What the flip? The tone shifts and changes are giving me whiplash. What are you thinking, you idiot? Go see through this ridiculous act of yours. I don't think it's an act. You say the silliest things, Vanitas. Oh my god! Did Her I voice tell changed. You before? We can handle it if we work together. No. Oh. He's a total maniac! <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna really sell it. A protracted battle will turn out in our favor. That in mind. What are you doing? <gasps> He's gonna throw him! Oh my god. No way, it's so good. <laughs> what? Pleased to meet you, Roland. Huh? Let me introduce myself. My name is Noe. I came with Vanitas to investigate an incident. Um. To the captain! <laughs> I mean. Now, do you think you're ready to listen? It seems like he's still in the catacombs because he was looking through, like, surveillance. Given that you are Chasseur Captain, you people only hunt the violent ones who go on rampages in the human Oh. World. Yes, of course. I That's see. A good point. So oh, the curse bearers, goodness. right? You certainly are an intriguing intruder. It's decided. No way. You and I shall be the best of friends. I want to learn every last thing there is to know about you. What? <laughs> No. Okay. No way, please don't. It was great. <laughs> the situation he understood. It worked out. I guess it did so work far. out. But I'm I guess they both did it kind of their if own way. If you'd explained yourself sooner, there would have been no need for the fisticuffs. He tried. But you didn't listen. Uh... I'm so He's just here. To you home. You're back. My number 69. Are... 
Number 69. Of course it's 69. <laughs> Doctor, for sure! That's an act. That, there's no way. Yeah, that's definitely an act. Uh, the tone that he used when he was describing his experiences down, uh, when he was a part of this organization, uh, seemed very sad. Uh, it, it appeared, or at least <laughs> the way he explained it implied that he experienced some pretty awful things and that he was, uh, that he faced a lot of traumatic experiences. So I don't think he's going to act that way towards the person I'm guessing is the one who caused those traumatic experiences. So maybe he's acting happy to see him to get close to him so that he can like, I don't know, stab him or something. Like why does he want to see this man again? Like why is he searching for him? Obviously he wants to help the people who are getting abducted and he wants to put a stop to it. Uh, so that could be literally the only reason or a part of it could be that he wants revenge against uh, the man who, you know, caused him such trauma. But anyways, I'm so happy that we're finally beginning to like piece together Bonnie Toss's past. Uh, his parents died. He was brought here at a very young age. He was experimented on. I don't exactly know what the experimentations were. Um, it could be because the reason why he has the gloves on. Uh, that could also be uh, because he has like the blue mark that signifies that he's part of the blue clan so that could be also a reason why he has the gloves on but i can only assume that they're not good and that they were probably quite painful and you know vanitas went through quite a lot of um again trauma and turmoil and you know pain and suffering until the blue vampire came in and rescued him like is vanitas the original vanitas is are they still alive? Are they dead? What happened to them? And why did um, the Blue Vampire give their name to the new Vanitas and their book? Like, I'm so curious about that whole thing and I really hope that, uh, you know, we start to get even more of Vanitas' backstory. But yeah, Noe and Vanitas' dynamics are really interesting. Uh, like I said, <laughs> the tone shifts, of this series gives me whiplash. One moment it's really like super serious and they're having such a uh, like deep, meaningful, philosophical moment. And the next is so comedic and wacky and you know, it's just so, oh God, it exhausts me. <laughs> um, if you guys enjoyed this video, please like for like, please dislike for dislike and tell me what I can do better. Please don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell so you can find every single time I make a video. And I wish you something and one of you a wonderful day, night, evening, afternoon, whatever you prefer. And I'll see you all in the next video. Bye.